this is JK, co-founder of Tradely Platform. I'm going to share today about platform business model and where the future economy is moving. Yeah, it's not going to be very um, very detailed, but just a brief idea. Okay, the first image which you see here, um, which is according to Sangit Paul, one of the guy who invented um, this platform economy model, who is not like inventor, who is able to differentiate what is the previous business model and what is the current business model. Yeah, he he mentioned about pipe versus platform. Pipe is like something like which starts from one and end, and it's 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 the and there is an end. Platform is that it's like many to many relationship. Industrial is like one to one relationship. What does that mean? Imagine when you are like buying a chocolate, yeah. If if you are buying like a chocolate or um, you do not know exactly how much is the cost to make the chocolate. Yeah, because it's produced in an industry, then it goes to a wholesalers, then it goes to a mid retailers, then it goes to the final retailer, then there could be other um, middleman in this whole supply chain before it reaches the customer. What happens in this pipe model when it's go uh, without with so many middleman is that the cost will have so many margins by this middleman and it increases the cost of the product. So this means the end customer gonna pay. With, let's say if you are gonna buy a chocolate, you're gonna pay more than what the chocolate is worth of. Yeah. In a platform model, what happened is that if let's say somebody is making the chocolate, he's gonna directly come into the marketplace, which is a marketplace platform, he's gonna put his item, a uh, end buyer will buy it. Of course, there can be retailers who can come and open the shop as well. But a platform economy open up anybody to who whoever who makes the product to come and put up the item. Let's say this is a supply side, they can come and open their different shop, they can sell the candies, uh, like say fashion items, anything they want, yeah. And the buyers will buy. What happens when it is an open platform? It's like there is a transparency. First, there is a transparency of who is selling and who is buying. Second, it's a fair trade. They clearly know how much this guy is selling and how much this guy is buying. So both of them satisfy, get satisfied. Then the third thing is that it it's, it's giving a level feel that anybody can come. It's not like, it's not going to be like, a, uh, I mean, if it's industry, it's not going to be easy um, to for, for an industry like a manufacturer to directly reach the consumer. It need to go to the multiple um, uh, multiple uh, middleman before each the customers otherwise they need to spend so much of money on marketing distributions and all those things opening up their stores when it's a platform it's a single digital platform so it's 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 going to be the same cost whether it's he's going to sell to his local place or he's going to sell to his uh, nearby states or to another country it's just a single platform here except it's just a logistics yeah so so the platform model allows a fat rate policy give the same feel for everybody to um, to transact each other and third uh, it's transparent as well yeah transparent um, fair and then level field yeah so 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 is this platform economy model is applicable for every industry it is it started with like transports fashions and all those things but it has been ventured into many things um, this is from a deal room .co. let's if we look at this this is on a mobility which is like uh, drivers and passengers yeah one side is the drivers and other side is the uh, passengers in uber eats it's like driver passengers and also a delivery partners booking.com it's a platform which connects the hotel owners and then the people who want to rent a place for a short term yeah amazon people want the one side is the people who buy and the other side is the people um, who sell delivero it's it's a food marketplace fat fetch is a luxury fashion destination you have this luxury uh, brand owners for example like Louis Vuitton Prada and all those things and the other side is the buyers Airbnb is the same like booking but is a different type of rental so Trivago it's again um, a property uh, no so it's a travel marketplace uh, and property uh, together and let go it's like um, it's like it's not a classified but it's like a social uh, marketplace C2C marketplace yeah so 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 it's not just in this industries it gonna expand into other uh, industries as well when this plat when this platform machination is gonna be um, applied in many industry the impact to the trade and the impact to the people who are in the both supply and demand 
is going to be huge and it's going to be positive as well that's what what we believe so we said to develop the digital infrastructure as well so this is some other examples i mean the scooters hailing in different thing how not everybody is a platform business model it's just an example yeah uh, and we have other things for example in finance you have like kickstarter um you have like kickstarter where okay yeah, just this thing uh, where the kickstarter where it allows anybody to fund each other um or like donate each other let's say if we think about healthcare i mean like this online pharmacies or online discussion platform where it allows for example doctors to help the patients so it's like allows multiple sides it can be multiple doctors it can be multiple patients yeah so a platform for a discussion then in real estate for example home search yes it's a very um, direct example in mobility it can be like somebody is like sharing their scooters or somebody is like sharing their car and all those things yeah and in other things like job search job search what is the platform initiation it's the companies which is the one side and another side is a job seeker so it's a single platform linkedin is the best example which connects multiple companies to put a job listing and multiple people to go and um, apply for jobs reschooling reschooling which is like school i mean schooling or reschooling or anything which is like teachers connected with the learners gig economy which is like freelance workers connected with the companies fashion people buy and sell products furniture also people can buy and sell their products pets is the same thing so in every industry we think yeah there is an opportunity for platformized so let's say if you have an idea and you wanted to test whether in this industry is, is it going to be applicable or if you have seen a model which is applied in uh, in, in some countries for example in europe um germany some places um and you wanted to replicate in your own country and you wanted to just quick start we have developed an infrastructure that can be shared which is a SaaS solution so you do not need to pay the whole cost for developing something from the scratch because we rebuild um i mean we build everything from the scratch we already have it for somebody to reuse it so let's say how it works when you when you come to us and then you tell that you want to launch a fashion marketplace we duplicate the solution yeah we duplicate the solution i mean it's just self so you can duplicate the solutions apply your own branding and customize how you want it your marketplace should be and then launch it all it can be done in um 10 to 50, uh, 10 to 20 days i mean in 10 days in less than 10 days the solution will be ready it's just that when you go on to launch in an app store or play store it's going to take some time why do people need to um, use our trade platform um, to launch their own marketplace it's because it's integrated with other things i mean let's say if you want to have a marketing tool it's integrated if you want to have analytical tools for example like google analytics like other analytics it's integrated delivery partners yes dhl and other things we are we in uh, end of this year we're gonna integrate with them payment gateways you have like stripe paypal and all those things data for example bigquery and all those things it's all implemented and it's crash platform you can just access our api and then you can build your own solution as well you can hire your own developers if let's say you wanted to have your own code base because as a SaaS provider we will not be sharing the code base to you all so let's say if you want to have your own asset your own code you can just access our api and build application on top of it and yes we do not provide infrastructure for everything but more on a platform business model so this is what what we do um, and i hope this has clarified what is platform economy model and where the future economy is moving so just to summarize platform economy model allows multiple sided to interact each other it can be a communication something like messenger or whatsapp it can be a transactional it can uh, which is like etsy amazon and all those things or it can be funding something like kickstarter gofundme and all uh, all those things and uh, it can be a transport as well like uber and property anything you imagine it can be platformized okay if you like it just hit like um, if there is any question just reach out to us